Eight million tons of plastic escape into the world's waterways and oceans every year. That equates to enough rubbish to stack five fully loaded bin bags on each foot of coastline around the world. Of the 6.3 billion tons of plastic ever produced, only 9% has been recycled. And if present trends continue, there will be 12 billion metric tons of plastic in landfill by 2050. But scientists in the UK believe they may have found a weapon in the fight against plastic pollution, and their inspiration came from nature. So what we've done, we've taken two enzymes from a bacterium that lives off plastic in plastic recycling dumps, um, connected them together in our laboratories here in Portsmouth, and this enzyme, super enzyme, actually works really fast, about six times faster than the original enzyme that we were looking at. The super enzyme they have created works by breaking plastics down to their constituent parts, in theory allowing that plastic to be recycled over and over again, reducing the need for new plastics to be created from fossil fuels. The team is now working with the recycling industry to see how this discovery could be put into use in the real world. Plastics in the environment can last hundreds of years, but clearly if we can take things into a recycling plant, we need to get things done in a matter of hours in order to make that process viable. The researchers are continuing their efforts and are currently testing hundreds of different enzymes which they hope will work even faster. Their aim is to have an arsenal of enzymes that recycling plants could use to put a dent in the amount of plastics going to landfill.